Word to the cool world. It's Jam TJ back again with another Jam's Views. I know it's been too long since I dropped some views. And I'm sorry, man. I've been working hard in school and just taking my time doing my studying. So I'm sorry. Bear with me. I apologize. I've been MIA for a while. Um, but I've been kind of going on thoughts of going through hell. And I know those of you out there have been going through hell as well, um, that rhyme scheme, but going through hell is just the tip of the iceberg. We're always going to have to go through some kind of roadblock or some kind of tension that's getting us away from where we are trying to go. And that comes with the process and I've always said trust the process but going through hell it sucks sometimes because sometimes you want to give up and you can't give up you got to keep going because if you give up going through hell so much and you don't finish what you wanted to do then you really didn't want your success as bad as you wanted it and I'm gonna get into that too but going through hell is the worst thing to go through, but it's the best thing to go through. And it brings you pain, it brings you headaches, it brings you self-doubt, and your self-awareness actually starts to diminish because you don't think that you can finish it, you don't think that you can handle what the world is giving you or what the world is throwing at you. Um, it's just something hard that we have to kind of come to terms and understand that we can actually do this. We we're built for this. You know, we weren't put on this earth just to exist. Like we were on the, put on this earth to actually do things and to make impacts in our lives and other people's lives and to actually make a staple in the world and actually be a human being and to actually be a creator in this world to create our lives to make our lives the best of it so there's a quote that i actually heard it said the scars that you got in life are the failures of when life tried to take you with it and it failed so think about that all your scars that you have whether it's mentally, whether it's physically, whether it's visually, all those scars that you have are all experiences. They're all your trials of what you had in the past. Everything that happened with you in the past that was bad, yeah, it may come back and it may put an imprint on you that it'll make you think in fear of that day when you felt that pain or when you felt that struggle or when you felt that defeat or when you felt, felt that failure, if anything. But you are still here today, right? You're still listening to me today, right? Like we've all gone through that. I know I've gone through my share of feeling defeated and feeling beaten down and feeling of struggles like I can't take this. And it's, it's hard, like it's hard every day we go through this and it's no one's ever a stranger to the downs but those up times are the best times so don't always reap on the best times to think that every day will be the best because there will be some roadblocks and there will be some times when the struggle is hard very hard so we have to go through hell to reach our success and that's this is why the analogy of climbing mountains is the best thing like whenever we say it's the struggle climbing this mountain it's the struggle to get up on this hill but the moral of climbing that mountain is not just to speak to everyone that you climb the mountain or to get these goals or to achieve yes i climbed the mountain no the moral of climbing that mountain is to actually see the world and everything what the natures of the world gives us 
and the tools of the world that gets us and what we use with the tools of the world to actually go through hell and digging our toes through the through the gravel through the dirt through all the mountain rocks and just digging and digging and grinding and grinding to reach the top of our success to get that ultimate happiness for because all that going through hell was actually the great benefit of what molds us to be the person that we are today don't ever take that for granted take that process and always use it and we have to practice what we preach and we have to teach and we have to uplift others when they're having a day or they're having times when they're going through hell we have to help them get out of that we have to help them but they have to also help themselves too and that's all a mental thing and that's all of a persistent thing so that's when it comes down to get that success to reach that success so as i was saying with the success of reaching eric thomas i highly 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 recommend you guys seeing eric thomas his video um if you haven't already if you have and you've watched it quite a few times kudos to you but if you haven't i again i highly recommend um watching his video on if you really want success as bad as you want to breathe that's when you'll be successful so please watch that please i cannot stress that enough if you want anything out of life and you want something to kick you in your ass or you want to feel some fire in your heart or you want the goosebumps to rise on your body watch that video watch that video and if you don't feel something inspiring or some kind of fire or warmth in your heart to get on your job or to get on your train of success then i don't know what to tell you i don't know what's going to help you to actually reach that man's motivation and that man's intensity level because he hit my heart and he hit it good and i'm very appreciative of that man so I advise y'all to keep going through hell, keep going through the struggle because I'm going through hell and I'm going through the struggle. And if you have a good support system and a good team of supporters, your friends, your family, your wife, your husband, your kids, all of them, if they're there to support you, then it really isn't hell. It's a rough patch, but we got to keep going and we got to reach that success. And as always, I need y'all to watch, listen, soak it in, watch the videos a couple times just to absorb what I'm saying and try to apply and, you know, and just visualize and, and work things out on how it's going to work in your favor. And that's all I can do. That's all we can do as human beings and as individuals. So I'm Jam J. This is Jam's Views. Never take off your cool. subscribe to the channel like the video pass it on to your friends share it to your family or just watch it a couple times and put it in your playlist so subscribe subscribe to jam's views channels i mean you wouldn't be disappointed i hope you're not disappointed but if you are disappointed leave me a comment in below and we'll talk about it and if you don't Keep watching and keep tuning in for more to come, all right?